Hi friends, I'm back. I know I look weird. Um, that is because I have already gone ahead and done all of my complexion makeup and my brows, and then my eyes are just completely bare, so I kind of look a little scary. Sowie. Um, that is because today we are going to do a review of this Tom Ford Eye Quad. Um, I actually did get sent this um, a couple of weeks ago, like maybe I think August, sorry. Um, and I was like, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a video and I just haven't had time, got a kid, it's, it's a pandemic and I have a nine to five job. So give me a break, but I'm doing it now and I'm doing it because I can't believe that four shades and two little brush thingies are $88. Yep, $88. So I I do have a Tom, Tom Ford product. Um, I use that eye defining pen. If you've seen my previous video, I actually used it in that video. I love it. I've had it for two years and it's just now starting to kind of like run out a bit. So like I do like them. Um, I just don't know if I can justify $88 for four shades when there's other high-end products that at that same price point that you can get 18 shades or 12 shades and they're just as good of quality. Maybe we'll see because I'm going to try this. So, um, yeah, we're gonna try this today. Get into it. And if you're new to my channel, hi, I know everyone says that, but like, Hey, I'm Jenna. I don't take myself seriously. I'm not a beauty guru. I don't want to be one. I don't claim to be one. I'm just a girl who really loves makeup, spends way too much money on makeup. And I'm like here to give honest reviews in a world where beauty influencers and influencers are getting paid for their opinions and you don't know who to trust. You can always trust me. Yes, I got sent this, but like I am not under any contract to even do a video about it or anything. They just sent it. I don't know. I just like came home and it was there, guys. I don't know. Um, yeah, so I'm not a beauty guru, but like, in these times, don't you kind of want to watch people who aren't beauty gurus and maybe like not as problematic? Ooh, yeah. So we're here for fun. If you want to have some fun, hang out, see if this is any good. Maybe you'll want to buy it. I don't know. Like that's why I'm here. I spend my money so you don't have to if I end up hating it and you hate it on me. I don't know. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, let's get into it. So opening it up, like it looks like a, you know, it's nice. It's magnetic. Ooh, $88 of magnets. And it's four shades, one shimmer shade, and three matte shades, very neutral. Um, as you can see, I have played around, like swatched the palette a little bit already. Um, and I've played with the brushes because these are the brushes you get. You get this really tiny brushes and this like really nice, it's very soft. It is a very nice quality of like tiny brush. Um, it's very nice quality. It's just, they're so small. And these look like something that you get in a Claire's makeup set like I don't know what that's about that seems a little cheap to me um to use in an $88 set you know you know what I'm saying like I'd rather you just give me two more shades in that place right instead of these like wannabe baby brushes like my son could use these well actually he'd eat these you know so it's disappointing so I think what I'm gonna do today, like this isn't gonna be a super long video, it's four shades, there's not much to talk about with that. Um, my complexion's done, like I said, so I look funny. So let's make me not look as funny by getting these on my face. Um, I'm gonna go in with this darker shade first into my crease and I'm gonna use their floofy brush for that. So why am I holding it so weird? I don't know, let's go into it. A lot, there's like kickback in the pan. I don't know if you can see that coming off. It's not too bad, like, whatever. All right, so I'm just gonna... And normally I do prime my eyes. Right now it just has my foundation on my eyes, but I kind of just wanna see what this product does with like without any primer or anything. I don't wanna enhance it. I really just wanna see what the formula is gonna do for itself because it's $88. It should do a lot. It should friggin' float onto my face for me. I shouldn't have to put it on. My jokes aren't funny, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I mean, it, it's a nice quality. Like, I, I knew it would be. I'm not like saying that these are $88 for trash, which isn't like, you know, I'm not gonna say names of makeup brands. But like, it, it blends out really nice. It's kind of hard to hold on to this tiny brush. 
Um, but like the brush feels nice on my face. I can like barely even feel it. It's very lightweight. Um, yeah, you know, like it's, it's nice. Not really much more to it. Like it, look how nice that went on. I barely even have to blend that out, you know, but I'm going to just blur the edges a smidgens. Subtle. She's subtle. My hair's crazy. As you can see, if you watch my previous video to now, I still don't know how to do this middle part stitch and hide my five head. But we're, it is an everyday thing, guys. I got a kid. We're working with it. <laughs> you know? Okay, so now I'm going to go in and give me a lot of options. You know? So let's go in with this shade. Also, these shades don't have names. So that's why I'm saying this shade. They don't have names. I can't tell you what it's called. Um, it's like a taupey color. I'm going to use their Claire's brush. <laughs> and I'm going to tap that on the outer corner because that's like really the only place you can kind of put these products. They've kind of got it set up in this quad to be very specific spots. You could probably put this in your crease, um, but it's pretty much meant to go exactly where I'm putting it. Um, goes on really easy. There's not really much fallout at all on my face, which is nice, you know. So they are really nice quality shadows. Um, that's for sure. So. Like. Hi. Cute. Um, now I'm going to use the shimmer shade. It's like a goldy shade. It's like every other shimmery gold shade that you'll see in every other palette. See that? It's nice. I'm just going to put it right in the middle of my lid. It's not as vibrant as I thought it would be. Honestly, like it swatches really nice, really vibrant. Like that's really pretty and buttery. But then when I put it on my face, my second dip into the pan, it's, it's very subtle, you know? If you like subtle makeup, I love subtle makeup. I just did a video about everyday makeup that was very subtle. Um, it did still have a pop of color to it, but you know, whatever, that's me. You know, if you do like everyday easy makeup, this is probably a good palette for you. I mean, you can chuck this in your bag so you can touch it up as you go through your day. If you're not going to be home all day and you've got to go like day to night look, you could probably make something with this. Um, you know, it's just comes at a pretty hefty price tag when something like a ColourPop mini palette would do probably the same thing just as well. So just keep that in mind. Um, I'm gonna use the really light shade for the inner corner of my eyes. You can't even see that on camera, but it's there. It's just really close to my natural color. It's got like a tinge of purple almost to it, like a pinky. I'm just gonna blend that with the gold. So I'm just gonna go back in with that gold side of this Claire's brush. And that's the eyeball. That took me, what, five minutes to do that whole entire thing. Um, let me finish my eyes. Like that was so fast. That's kind of nice, you know? But let me finish the rest of my eyes, my liner and my mascara, and then I'll come back with final thoughts. Back. Two seconds for you, 10 minutes for me. Had to get, you know, once again, wing situation, whatever. Um, so final thoughts really quickly on this palette. Quality is really nice. Um, goes on super easy. As you saw, it took me like five minutes to do a really nice, natural, neutral makeup look. Um, so it is really great. Quality is great. There's no denying that. Packaging's nice. Um, and you can just chuck it in your bag and go. So that's great. Um, I still have an issue with $88 for this. I think, like I said before, there's um, similar brands at the same price point where you get a lot more shadows um, for that price. So that's gonna be my main qualm with this. I would never spend $88 on four shades, and that's just me. Um, I'd rather spend $78 or $87, whatever that was, on the Pat McGrath palette um, that comes with all of these. Highly recommend this palette. I'll probably do a video with it soon. Um, I just got it, so stay tuned for that one. But yeah, I would rather spend the money on this. This is gonna last longer. This is, a, I love Pat McGrath. Oh my God. Bible, I have like three of her palettes and I love them all um, and they're all worth the price. So 
I would never buy this um, if it wasn't sent to me. Will I use it because I have it? Yeah, I probably will. Um, but I just don't think I could, I could never justify $88 for four shades. And I justify buying a lot of makeup. So I think that should say a lot. Um, but hey, if you like this, great. Um, I don't know what, you just can't create a lot of looks with that shade, you know, with those choices. It's gonna kind of be the same repetitive, maybe two different looks that you can do with it. Five maybe, if you're like super creative. Good for you. Um, but yeah, that's my thoughts on that. Um, hope you liked the video. Kept it a little shorter this time because um, there's not a lot when there's four shades. So um, yeah, come hang out with me. Subscribe, like the video, comment something. Um, you know, tell me a little bit about yourself. I tell you a lot about myself. I do all the talking. I'd love to hear someone else talk. Um, my Instagram and all that stuff's linked if you want to hang out with me there. I got a TikTok too. That's a lot of fun. Love me some TikTok. Um, and those aren't makeup videos. Those are just fun. So yeah, uh, thanks for hanging out with me. We'll hang out again like next week or something. Let's make a date. You know, we're here for fun. I'm not a gu guru. Hope you liked it. I hope you don't spend $88 on it. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. You can spend it. It's okay. I approve. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. I'm going to stop talking now. Bye.